Hello, I'm Snubber Jack, and today, um, don't judge me, don't get angry, I'll explain all seriousness at the end of the video. But pretty much, uh, this video is uh, the difference between men and women. <laughs> and I imagine women uh, will be like, yeah, okay, that's kind of true, actually. And then guys will be like, yeah. And that is that is pretty much the sum of this video anyway. So should we just get into it and try and cause problems between differences? Okay, let's <laughs> just get into it. Okay, so <laughs> how we see colours, right? Women, scarlet, dark red, wine red, plum, eggplant, grape, purple, lavender, all these different colours. Men, red, violet, pink, orange, yellow, green. <laughs> it's, it's kind of true. I'm not going to lie. I don't really say maroon or burgundy. I did the other day because a certain colour... On, on my guitar is a, actually classed as burgundy, but that's just because it said it when I ordered it, you know. But uh, it is mainly red. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't think my girlfriend does this. Um, she says turquoise, turquoise a lot, because, um, you know, that's her, has, uh, you know, I can't remember the word, but um, yeah, that's her thingy. And salmon and all that crap, oh my god. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm regretting doing this already. <laughs> okay, the, okay, this one's kind of true. Um, I don't see myself like that. I don't want to get, like, shredded. But, see, my girlfriend says... Um, I remember her saying that she doesn't care about whether she's fat or not. But as soon as I make some sort of fat joke, she obviously cares because she gets really pissed off. So yeah, I can I can understand that. I can kind of understand that. I don't <laughs> I don't I don't really think every guy wants to be fucking shredded and can pick up a bus. But yeah, I mean <laughs> See this is fine. Like these two people, they're absolutely fine. They're just like they're not happy with their their size, so they're like, yeah, I wanna be shredded. Yeah, I really don't want to fat off. So it's like, oh, fuck's sake. Who fucking cares? Ah. Okay, this... <laughs> this one's kind of true. Uh, it's not that I'm not popular or unpopular. It's because I don't use social network that much. Whereas with my girlfriend, she does, and her phone goes off quite a lot. Um, it's mostly phone calls, to be honest, or messages. It's never Facebook. Or she goes on Instagram... Or looks at a fucking music please. I can't stand music please, but she's always on it. And yeah, I got. <laughs> That's kind of true, actually. This is kind of accurate. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of accurate, actually. <laughs> yeah, when I think about it, that's uh, that is on point. <laughs> this oh god. Oh, this one's so annoyingly accurate. Right. I, to be honest, when I go out, um, I'm pretty much ready straight away. But this is incredibly true. Um, this. <laughs> right. Right. It's the stereotype that women take ages to get ready, right? And that guys are instantly, you know, they're, they're done. Right. We have to leave at 7 p.m. to be time. Be in time for dinner. Sure, honey. <laughs> I'll go and get dressed. It's still on the computer. This is me. And then... Go drying. And then, finally ready. I'm not ready yet. Let's go. <laughs> it's very true. Um, when I'm... I, I normally... I'm doing work or playing on my computer or something before my girlfriend comes over. And she has to wait about half an hour. 45 minutes until I get off my computer and actually spend time with her, which is really bad. So the computer is kind of true. Um, I don't always sit in my underwear, though. Um, I'm not a slob or anything. I'm just trying to prove a point that I'm... I'm I, I, right. I'm right. 
I think. I'm not right, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of half. I'm going to shut up. <laughs> okay, right. Football, no. TV, sex, food, sex, beer, sex. 100%. 100% apart from the, the shoes. Uh, my girlfriend doesn't care about shoes. She always wears wine all the fucking time and it pisses me off. Babies, yeah, she makes a joke about it, but she clearly does. Love, yes. Security, yes. Talk, yes. All of that is pretty much on point. All of this, apart from the football, is on point. Like, <laughs> is that really bad that it's completely accurate? Is every relationship like this? Is it is it normal? I I I'm gonna move on to the next one before I get murdered by my girlfriend tomorrow. There's a big difference between a man and woman saying I went through a whole box of tissues watching a movie last night. <laughs> oh my god, that's <laughs> Yes! <laughs> That is actually fucking accurate to a fucking point. Um, see, my girlfriend does cry quite a bit when it's an emotional film. And then she looks at me thinking, I'm going to cry, and I don't. It's very rare that she does, but when it's a really soppy film, she will cry. But yeah, a whole box of tissues for a guy watching a movie. I mean, not a whole box of tissues, he's fucking hell. You'd, you'd be costing a fortune, you'd, you know. Um... Yeah, you get the idea of that one, you know, the old, the old snap, the old snake and that. Pretty much having a wank, yeah, if you didn't get that, you know, stroking your dick until you come, pretty much. That's, that's what it's... men do to upset women. Lie. Be honest. <laughs> okay, they're contradictory, but actually, to be honest, ah, uh, there you go. It actually does piss off a lot of people, especially my girlfriend. If I lie to her, it pisses her off. If I'm even honest about something, sometimes it pisses her off. Not talking to them when they want attention pisses them off. And then talking to them too much when they're doing something pisses them off. Not showing any emotions annoys them. And then being too emotional annoys them. And then last of all, that's an exaggeration, but breathing. <laughs> breathing? I think if I stop breathing, I think she'd be a bit concerned, wouldn't you? But all <laughs> in some sense, right, and I mean this in the nicest way, women are fucking mental, okay? They're like fucking fairground rides. They're fucking insane, okay? I <laughs> oh, I've, I've started something now. All of this is true. Not an exaggerated. It's not exaggerated. It is true, though. Uh, I do... I do... <laughs> I'm going to move on to the next one before I accidentally castrate myself. I hate this one with a fucking passion, right? Because this is so fucking true to, to me, right? Men don't fight, they argue, okay? And then when it's a proper fight, that's it, you're, you're no longer friends. If I disagree with one of my friends, it's like this, yeah? Don't punch each other, just like, oh, fuck off then, you know? After five minutes, fine, go have a drink, make a sandwich, whatever the fuck you do. Women fight, they fucking argue for fucking hours. And then after two years, I wouldn't say two years, like fucking forever, they're still fucking angry at each other. They hold grudges, we do not. This is not even fucking a lie. In my eyes, this is fucking truth. Because I, I've experienced this for fucking ages. This is so fucking true, it's unreal. I hate it though, because it's so annoyingly true. Why can't it just be, like, fucking normal? Why? Ah! I'm a guy. I just... I just... <laughs> yeah, but it's easy for a woman. All they need to do is grab your dick, and then it's over, isn't it? They're just... That's it. I'm, I'm, you're all over them, then. For a woman, you have to fucking foreplay and shit. It's annoying. You want to get straight into them. You've got to be patient. you got to get all the right but some foreplay and kiss her on the neck and shit before they even get a little bit horny. And then for a guy, it's like, oh, there you go, there's my dick. It's like, it's not, it's not fair. It's like, I hate, I fucking hate it sometimes. Why can't women just fucking just be constantly wet? No, that's, that's not normal, is it? I think there'd be something wrong with them, isn't there? I mean, there's something wrong with them anyway. I'm going to shut up. But they are going to get slapped tomorrow. I just, it's so fucking annoying. 
Why is why is the world like this? Why is this fucking true? Ah! No! 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 I don't want it! I don't want it! I hate this shit. <laughs> I'm upset now. Now, in all seriousness, it's fucking true, okay? It's all of it's fucking true. An exaggerated truth, but it is true on some level. Most women, they get fucking funny about things that you do and things that you don't do. Women are fucking complicated as shit. It's like a Rubik's Cube that you can never fucking do. Is the best way of explaining it. I just don't fucking know. I don't know. I don't know. No, but in all seriousness, yes, it, it's annoying because um, it's just annoyingly true. So yeah, anyway, I just thought I'd make a video out of it and just prove a point. And um, I think my point is proven, and I'm probably going to have some sort of angry, bickering argument with my girlfriend tomorrow. So I did it myself. But then it's something a guy can do later on is that apologise and be like, oh, I'll get you something nice or I can make you dinner or make you do something. <laughs> but yeah, that is pretty much the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. As I said, it is an exaggerated thing. It's just me messing around. Um, guys, guys don't have it as hard as women, trust me. <laughs> Women are just fucking annoyingly always there. And they're just, yeah. Anyway, I'm done. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Follow me on my social media down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Back from the dead.